you've ever wondered if you can do gardening or growing on your own, here's examples. <clears throat> this here is an arm that broke off of my one of my tomato plants out back. I stuck it in the water, pulled all the leaves off. This is a new leaf here growing. And look, all those roots. I'll add a little bit more water, unchlorinated, and let it grow a little bit more, get a few more leaves going, then add it into some soil, and it will take off just like any other tomato plant. If it'll be too late in the season, I will just take it and put it in a pot in here where I have all my grow lights. It'll grow slower, but it will still grow. Here, another example. These are literally seeds that have, they've grown from seed that are strawberry plants. I have two here. I have, if I can find them. Another one here. And then there is another one here. They're very tiny when they're coming up, but they're coming up and it can be done. These are sprigs from my chocolate mint plant. I just cut them off, stuck them in there, no roots, no nothing, and look at them go. Another way that you can grow herbs from home is buy one of these con containers that have everything contained in it. Just use my chocolate mint here. They come with the jars, with the inside filters, with everything included, a little bit of soil and some charcoal that goes on top, top act activated charcoal, and the seeds. They come in seed packs, I just uh, taped them on, and they have been going for about a week or two. When it gets down so far, you can add more water to it, again, non-chlorinated. And if all you have is chlorinated, that's fine, it will work. That's all you have, don't let it stop you from growing. Um, you can always get <coughs> non-chlorinated water from the grocery store in a gallon jug and just use it particularly for your plants at home if that's what you wanna do. But there's a lot of times when I just put water strictly, directly out of my sink. This is just another way. This is basil, cilantro, and mint. Growing from home can be simply starting small. And another example of being able to start from home is these are all mulberry pieces from mulberry branches now not all of them have taken off yet and i fill the bottom up with water Whoop. and i have holes in these cups two or three around the side so they water feed from the bottom and <clears throat> several of them this one had leaves on it but this one is has leaves. This one, you can see the bottom here has leaves. And there's several of them in here that do have leaves that are growing. There's another one right here. This one here is growing leaves from the bottom down here. <clears throat> you can grow at home on a metal shelf with a shop light. Mine is a grow light, but a shop light works just as well. I got these on a clearance sale, so if you can do that, that's great. If not, shop lights work. I use those first, and I use them during the winter time also sometimes if I don't need as much light like this for my plants. Start small, start anywhere it can be done. Just start. Cabbage is starting. Look at that. My cucumber. Plant thing. 
Ayan. Starting. Oh, God, I'm starting now. Oh, 